Humans are made to stay on land, which explains why many of us are terrified of oceans and other huge bodies of water. They're unfamiliar, and one wrong move can easily lead to your death. There are also a lot of things lurking underwater, and most of them can easily end our lives. After all, the water is their domain, and we're at their mercy. The largest body of water is the ocean, and to this day we still have a lot to discover about it. The ocean is full of mystery, and that's enough to make anyone terrified of exploring the deepest parts. With that being said, let's take a look at some of the most bone-chilling discoveries underwater. From the serpent skeleton to the ocean atlas, here are 15 most terrifying things recently discovered underwater. Number 15. Serpent Skeleton From afar, this looks like the remains of a giant snake. Depending on the tides, parts of the serpent skeleton might become submerged, hidden from onlookers, or it might be completely exposed. It's a bit terrifying to think that such a huge serpent exists, but this is just an art installation made from aluminum. This installation is located off the shore of the Loire River where it empties into the Bay of Biscay near Nantes, France. Anyone passing by the river for the first time will surely be a bit terrified upon seeing this colossal serpent skeleton. After all, it's nearly 425 feet long, and when the support underneath is hidden by the water, the art installation is incredibly realistic. It's been a few years since this installation was completed, and ever since, it's been in a perpetual state of decay. Up close, this structure makes you believe that it can move any time. Its curved skeleton might make it look more menacing, but the curves represent the nearby Saint-Nazaire Bridge. This structure is the work of Wang Yongping, a contemporary artist who based the skeleton on China's mythological dragons. What do you think this art installation means? What message did the artist want to express? Let me know what you think in the comments below. Before we go on, like this video, smash the subscribe button, and click the notification bell right now. Number 14. Brittle Stars this is the Brittle Star, and it's one of the strangest creatures we've discovered in recent years. This alien-looking creature with a flat body and several long wriggly arms isn't only weird in its appearance. Brittle stars are echinoderms, just like starfish. There are more than 2,000 known species of brittle stars, and their populations are scattered all around the world. Some live in shallow waters, while others live in places as deep as 11,000 feet. Unlike their kin, brittle stars have strange quirks. Each of these creatures' arms function independently, and they can make their own decision about how to react to stimuli in their environment. Think of it as five independent worms thinking on their own, and only joining together through the nerves in the central disc. If they're in danger, they can lose any of their arms and just grow them back as long as the central disc or the main body stays intact. And it gets weirder. One particular species of brittle star, Red Ophiocoma, has no visible eye, but it can still see by turning its skeleton into eyes. Essentially, these creatures have crystals or lenses on their arms with photoreceptor cells in between, which enables them to see. We still don't know just how much they can, though, and scientists continue to be awed by this strange but magnificent creature. Number 13. Jaws Can you hear the Jaws theme music yet? This underwater statue will surely freak you out. Just take a look at those cartoonish but strangely lifelike teeth. This shark was surely made to give divers the heebie-jeebies. Fortunately, this shark isn't real, and no matter how big his mouth is, he won't swallow you anytime soon. This statue can be found in Lake Nucatel in Switzerland. Imagine if some divers had absolutely no idea that it exists. They would probably let out a small scream in their wetsuits. Very little is known about this terrifying shark statue, and internet sleuths only managed to trace the shark back to a film called Chocolat. I guess whoever designed the shark made it so that its appearance gets more unsettling over time. It's been years since this shark was installed underwater, so it's starting to show signs of wear. But I think the rust and chipped paint just make it look all the more sinister. Number 12. Salish Sea Human Foot Discoveries It's a nice day to walk along the beach, and suddenly, you stumble upon a shoe. Nothing unusual. Some objects get washed up on the shore, after all. But something compelled you to inspect the shoe further. And as you walked closer, you noticed that someone or something was still wearing the shoe. Severed human feet. 
Since 2007, at least 20 detached human feet have been found on the coasts of the Salish Sea in British Columbia, Canada and in Washington, United States. When the first one was found, it was immediately speculated that it was the work of a serial killer. However, in 2017, British Columbia Coroner Service claimed that foul play wasn't a possibility based on the investigations. It appears that the people in question died due to accidents and other causes. Even after the official statement, though, conspiracy theories still lingered on the internet. Alien activity, illegal human experiments, the theories get wilder and wilder. That is, until science proposed a simple explanation. As unsettling as this strange phenomena is, the truth might be simple. Human bodies usually sink to the seafloor, and as it decomposes, opportunistic feeders will start to feast on the corpse. Fish, shrimp, and crustaceans can turn a corpse into a skeleton in under four days. When that happens, the feet float back up, largely due to the buoyant shoes, and travel the ocean until they get washed up on the shore. Even with a logical explanation, finding severed feet can still make anyone run away. Number 11. Baltic Sea Anomaly this photo is a sonar image captured by Peter Lindbergh, Dennis Aberg, and their Swedish Ocean X diving team. They noticed this strange feature while treasure hunting on the floor of the northern Baltic Sea. Let me ask you, what does it look like to you? For Lindbergh, this strange shape is a formation that was constructed tens of thousands of years ago, before the Ice Age. He even theorized that they might have found Atlantis, the mythical underwater city that has been lost for years. Lindbergh and his team even brought up some rock samples from the strange formation. But the thing is, scientists seem to believe that they've discovered nothing special while the team claims otherwise. We still don't know if their discovery actually poses some significance. But one thing is for sure, experts completely dismiss the Baltic Sea anomaly as a strange natural formation underwater. Number 10. Bimini Road Bimini Road, also called the Bimini Wall, is a 0.5-mile-long linear feature composed of limestone blocks. Ever since its discovery, the Bimini Road has been shrouded in mystery, and we continue to wonder what exactly this underwater feature is. It was discovered in 1968 by a diver on the northwest coast of North Bimini Island. While some people think that the Bimini Road is just a natural rock formation, many believe that these limestone blocks make up the missing road of Atlantis. Atlantis first appeared in an allegory written by the famous philosopher Plato. It was described as a powerful and advanced kingdom that had fallen. Atlantis is most likely a mythical island nation, but many still believe that Atlantis truly existed. For thousands of years, many treasure hunters and divers have tried to discover the lost city in hopes of finding gold and treasure. There have been many claims that they found a part of the lost city, but all of them lack solid proof. Bimini Road is one of these discoveries. After the Bimini Road was discovered, two similar roads were found, further spurring excitement among the public. Unfortunately, the truth turned out to be a little disappointing. Carbon dating of the Bimini Road suggests that they were naturally made through geological forces, easily destroying theories about the Bimini Road being a part of a lost city or an ancient civilization. Number 9. Giant Phantom Jellyfish The Embodiment of Doom and Gloom at least that's what it looks like, is the giant phantom jellyfish. It might remind you of the Grim Reaper or a Dementor from that one wizard movie. And trust me, anyone who sees the phantom jellyfish will feel unnerved about its appearance at first. It looks like a floating piece of fabric gracefully moving in the ocean, and its dark color suits its name. We've only encountered this animal a hundred times, so I guess just like ghosts, they're quite elusive, and studying them is pretty hard. These bizarre creatures live at a depth of a staggering 3,200 feet, which is also one of the reasons why they're so hard to see. Water pressure in this depth reaches up to a crushing 5,800 pounds per square inch. No human can survive this pressure, but these creatures have soft, gelatinous bodies that help them survive. Basically, jellies might be soft, but they're pretty tough. They look really spooky, and their size helps them to be more intimidating. The sun hat shaped bell of the phantom jellyfish can be up to 3.3 feet wide, and its velvety arms can grow up to a whopping 33 feet long. Their size makes them among the largest jellyfish on the planet. Oh, and have I told you that the arms you see are also mouths? Aside from its monstrous eating habit, not much is known about this elusive jellyfish, and hopefully we'll get more opportunities to study them in the future. 
Number 8. Giant Squid We've long read stories about giant squids and colossal sea creatures that trap and eat sailors in the middle of the ocean. For so long, we believe that these creatures are nothing but fictional creatures. But did you know that recently, researchers finally captured a specimen of a giant squid? The largest giant squid observed was 33 feet long, making it the length of a bus, and they weigh at least 1,000 pounds. If they're so big, why are they so hard to capture then? Well, it's mainly because just like the ghost jellies, giant squid also live in the most inhospitable and unforgiving parts of the ocean. Sightings of these creatures are so rare that the only photos we have of a live giant squid were captured by a team of researchers in Japan in 2004. The giant squid's eyes are extremely massive. They can measure up to 10 inches in diameter, making them have one of the largest eyes in the animal kingdom. Their huge eyes are extremely helpful in navigating the lightless depths of the ocean, where other animals would see nothing. Aside from their size, giant squid are pretty much just like their smaller relatives. They have eight arms and two longer feeding tentacles. They eat mainly fish, shrimp, and other squid, but evidence suggests that they also go for small whales. Yikes! So far, there are no official reports of giant squid eating or attacking humans. Number 7. Silphra Crack You've probably seen posts where people stand between borders to make themselves exist in two places simultaneously. You can be in two towns at once, two cities at once, and even two countries at once. But did you know that there's a rift in the ocean where divers can exist literally in between two continents? You can even touch two continents at once. Located in the Thingvallavatn Lake in the Thingvallir National Park in Iceland, the Silfra Crack is a part of the Atlantic Rift that divides the continents of Europe and America. The Silfra Crack is a popular spot for amateur and professional divers. The water here is crystal clear, to the point where you can see more than 100 yards ahead of you. The water in the rift is actually melted glacier water, which also means temperatures here are freezing from about 36 to 39 degrees Fahrenheit. This rift was formed in 1789 by earthquakes that came with a divergent movement of the two tectonic plates. This supports the theory of continental drift. Essentially, land masses continuously drift across the Earth. This explains why North America and Europe split apart, and why India began to drift toward Asia. To this day, the Silphra crack continues to widen ever so slowly due to continental drift. For many divers, exploring Silphra might be a dream, but for people with thalassophobia, or those who have an extreme fear of the ocean, touching two continents is off their bucket list if it means being submerged in cold water. Number 6. World's Oldest Intact Shipwreck In 2018, archaeologists announced that they might have found what they believed is the world's oldest intact shipwreck. They found the lonely wreck at the bottom of the Black Sea, where it appears to have stayed undisturbed for more than 2,400 years. The vessel was about 75 feet, and based on its structure, it appeared to have been an ancient Greek vessel. What makes this discovery so special? It's unusual to see shipwrecks thousands of years old still intact. Over time, the water, oxygen, and living organisms would influence the material slowly decaying the vessel, and after years, it would slowly disappear. It just so happens that this Greek ancient vessel was emerged in an environment with a lack of oxygen, which preserved the ship. Prior to this discovery, the ship had only been seen in Greek pottery. Now, researchers can freely examine the vessel to learn more about shipbuilding in the ancient world. But of course, to preserve the ship, scientists claim that they would leave it where they originally found it. A small piece of the ship was retrieved from the wreck, however, and the results confirmed that it was indeed the oldest shipwreck known to mankind. Number 5. Blind Cuskeel It seems like the more creatures we discover in the deep sea, the longer the list of the scariest ocean creatures gets. This is the blind cusk eel, and it's among the ocean monsters discovered by scientists recently. Right off the bat, they look weird and unnerving. A fish with no scales, no eyes, and a gelatinous texture. Weird and slimy have always been a bad combination. Blind cusk eels can be found in the world's tropical and subtropical waters at depths of about 2,300 feet. There are other species of cusk eels, but this one looks like the living dead. Its eyes might look non-existent at first, but if you look closely, you'll notice that it actually has eyes, but it's unpigmented, making it the same color as their flesh. Their slimy-looking body is also gelatinous, which makes them survive the unrelenting pressure in their habitat. 
We know that most deep sea creatures look like real life monsters because they need to adapt to their harsh environment, but that doesn't make them less terrifying. Another weird thing about these guys is even as they mature, they still have larval characteristics. Their skeleton, muscles, and gills are kind of unfinished looking. Their eyes and other organs are reduced. Let's just say they're mostly underdeveloped, but also not really. Some features of the blind cusk eel may be underdeveloped, but certainly not their reproductive habits. Males produce packets of sperm, which are called spermatophores. After creating them, he hands them over to the female for her to deal with later. The female blind cusk keeps the spermatophores with her to fertilize her eggs whenever she's ready. Think about it like an engagement ring or packet. Anyway, I'm sure there are a lot of creatures in the ocean that are weirder and scarier than this eel, but they deserve to be among the top 20. And now it's time for today's topic. Former Navy officer tells us what he saw while diving in the Arctic. This is a photo of a creature known as Ningen. In Japanese, this word literally means human, and I guess it makes sense that this creature got this name because of its human-like appearance. Well, mostly human-like appearance. These creatures were said to live in the icy waters of the Arctic, and they're described differently depending on what story you believe. Some say that the Ningen is the height of an adult human, while some say they're gigantic. They also allegedly have hind legs that enable them to walk on land, while some contradict this idea, claiming that Ningens have mermaid tails or fins. There are also rumors that a Japanese research vessel was the first to spot this terrifying creature, and it wasn't long until other people spotted it. Do you think this creature really exists? Or do you think this cryptid is just an imaginary creature that only exists in people's minds? Let me know what you think in the comments below. As always, comment down below with the hashtag today's topic and let us know your opinion about what we just showed on screen. With that said, let's keep things moving. Number 4. Giant Black Smoker There are no chimneys underwater, but there are hydrothermal vents. Lots of them. Giant black smokers are hydrothermal vents that emit black smoke underwater. They're formed by accumulations of iron sulfide, and they eject superheated hydrothermal water from below the crust, which means the environment around these underwater chimneys are lethal. And yet, life seems to flourish even in the most impossible places. For instance, there are deep sea creatures here that treat this dangerous superheated water as a deep sea sauna. Worms and other creatures manage to survive in the environment around the black smoker and not only survive its water, but also the crushing pressure of the ocean. Number 3. Red Coffin Fish The red coffin fish just might be the saddest creature in the ocean. Just take a look at that downturned mouth. These odd-looking creatures thrive at the bottom of the ocean, where they frown, and frown some more. They look like they're either about to cry or spontaneously burst into anger. But enough of this fish slander. These sea dwellers may be fish, but they actually walk on the seafloor. Instead of swimming, they use their fins to move around the seafloor. They're also pretty slow-moving creatures that eat anything that fits their mouth. There are also claims that the red coffin fish can hold its breath, but a scientist claimed that perhaps the fish only held its breath because it was annoyed by the lights and cameras filming it. What a grumpy lad! Number 2. The Great Blue Hole this underwater sinkhole, also known as the Great Blue Hole, is located about 60 miles off the coast of Belize. This hole lies near the center of Lighthouse Reef. It's about 1,000 feet across and about 400 feet deep. According to researchers, the sinkhole appeared after the collapse of a cavern formed during the glacial period tens of thousands of years ago. No one knows how old this hole actually is. It could have been as many as 153,000 years ago or just 60,000. It might look like the entrance to another world, but the Great Blue Hole is in fact one of the world's most popular diving zones and is the home to a wide biodiversity of ocean creatures, including Caribbean reef sharks, nurse sharks, hammerheads, and blacktip sharks. Number 1. Ocean Atlas In Greek mythology, Atlas was one of the titans that was punished after leading the rebellion against Zeus. As punishment, he was condemned to hold up the heavens for all eternity, carrying a huge burden on his shoulders. But did you know that we have an underwater counterpart to Atlas? This is the world's largest underwater statue located in the Bahamas. It's a sculpture depicting a young girl carrying the weight of the ocean above her. From above, the statue's position is almost heartbreaking. 
and the artist successfully made it seem as if the weight of the ocean is crushing the girl. All of the materials used for this artwork are environmentally friendly, since the sculpture hopes to send a message about the importance of our oceans and how we must take care of it. Which of these underwater discoveries intrigued you the most? And do you know any other terrifying underwater stories? Make sure to share them in the comments below. Also, check out our other cool stuff showing up on the screen right now. And I'll see you in the next video. Take care, everybody.